Chicken here to bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're going to be discussing where is... Guys, where, where's the Mega Crab? Where's the next Mega Crab? Why isn't it here yet? Um, and <clears throat> just based on past Mega Crabs and stuff, I wanted to uh, just talk about this next one coming up. And just like some things that I would like to see from it. Uh, some stuff I would get excited about. And uh, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and dive on into it, guys. So we're going to be using uh, Zookas, of course, and the... Uh, and uh, we're going to use all the hero abilities. I'm just going to go through them one by one until we need battle orders at the end. Uh, is basically what I'm thinking of how we're going to run it here. So, uh, the Mega Crab, guys. So, let's talk about um, what we've seen from the Mega Crab so far. So, we got, um, we know we got the first one, uh, January 15th of 2016. Uh, we, we soon after got the second one, uh, last year, of course. Um, and it was March uh, 25th, 2016. And then we got... Um, july 1st and then october 28th which was the halloween one and then uh the last one which was january 5th um excuse me january 27th and that one lasted for five days so in in terms of the mega crab cycle we're actually off by like a month like um we should have got it last month right but we but everyone knows that we got the hero update and all that jazz uh which was great to see so i'm thinking we're kind of due for a for a mega crab to land uh, sometime soon if I had to guess um, I would say within the next month maybe two months at most I would think um, because I mean well think about it this way like uh, at this point right now if uh, two months had gone by we had already had two mega crabs in that time since last year but obviously it's not like it's a bad thing because we didn't get uh, any sort of massive update like we got the hero update this year so it's not like um, it's not like I'm complaining or saying like oh where's the mega crab like nothing's going on like obviously there's a lot going on but uh I just think we're kind of due for a, for another Mega Crab really soon here, guys. I forgot to switch from the Cluster Grenade, so... Uh, some things that I would like to see, I think they could get really creative with it now that uh, we've had... Um, like, with the Hero Update and, and how they could do stuff with the with the Mega Crab, so... I got a couple ideas here, guys, um, and, and definitely let me, let me know what you think of them down in the comments and all that uh, back stuff. Um, so... <clears throat> I would like to see them, um, like I know some of this might be impossible or whatever, but uh, I would like to see them bring back all the special defenses, like the uh, the pumpkin mortar, uh, as much as I hated it, uh, the taunt tower, the, um, the 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 cryo bomb, um, just basically all the all the all the different things that they brought in, and don't necessarily have them um, on e every single level, but I'd like to see them kind of cycled in for each, um, like say like. Maybe it's even automatic like every three stages, you know, you're gonna get a taunt tower stage every like uh, Third stage you're gonna get a pumpkin order stage like something along those lines You know what? I mean, I think that would be fun and kind of keep the stages a little more fresh because they do get repetitive especially in the last one with uh, With like all the taunt towers and stuff like you knew it was just gonna be some sort of like monstrous uh, heavy zooka attack uh, fully boosted was gonna be required in like the later stages obviously um, So I think something like that would kind of keep it like a little more fresh and would just be like a lot more fun in general um, just to be able to kind of plan and have an idea of like, okay, like it's going to be pumpkin mortars this time. So like this troop or whatever is going to be best for it. So something like that, I think would be cool. Just to kind of spice it up a bit. So it's not just the same, like heavy Zooka fully boosted the uh, scorcher tank, um, or like whatever. Um, I think that would be cool to see. And then, um, <clears throat> I think the new, and then of course they got to come out with a new special defense for this, right? And I think this mega crab would work, um, it, it would have to work a lot off the hero update, right? So I think the new special defense, like... It, it's it has to be the mega turtle guys like it, it just has to be at this point um uh, it could be dr tear's own personal hero he can he can have like some kind of commercial or whatever where he says like oh like i see you got these new heroes and then like look what i brought in and uh it's the mega turtle and then maybe it works like it's just this um uh hero that just kind of wanders around the base and works against you like I, there's a million a million ways to go with it from there but i mean uh, I think that would just be really cool to see. I forgot to switch the freaking ability again, but, um, and it, like, um, I, I've actually talked about how the Mega Turtle could work in a previous video, but, I mean, more or less, just, it would, uh, it would walk around the base, and then it would, um, like, your troops would target it and stuff, and, like, maybe it would take out a few, maybe it would take out a lot, like, who knows, they could get really creative with that. I think that would be really cool to see, um, and I think that would make a lot of sense, uh, with the hero update and, like, the amount of times we've heard about the Mega Turtle and it hasn't actually turned into anything, I think that would be really cool to see. Um, 
So here's where it gets interesting, guys. Here's where I think it could get uh, really exciting, especially for higher level players. Let's go ahead and switch to uh, Everspark here, guys. Um, so I think around stage 30 is where most people that are purely playing uh, the Mega Crab to farm loot, which is a perfectly viable thing to do on Mega Crab. You can get a ton of power, you can get a ton of resource, especially if you're low level. Um, and you can get up to level 30 without boosting and just kind of playing regularly, like without spending a lot of diamonds or whatever. Uh, but I think past stage 30, again, it, it, it depends on, on the type of Mega Crab with the last one. Stage 30 would require maybe a bit of boost if you're going to do it relatively quickly. Um, but I think that would be um, <clears throat> around the stage where this could come into effect. And what I'm talking about is I think what they could have for this one, again, incorporating the hero update into it a little bit, uh, they could have the trader uh have some kind of like animation like maybe lands down on stage 30 and be like hey chicken like i see you're taking down the mega crab uh, i was able to hack his base and for every future stage that you're going to take down i'm going to be able to get you um extra hero tickets or trader tickets and, and hero tokens and stuff like that um and then past stage 30 the maybe they don't give or maybe they give very little amounts of wood iron and uh and stone i think that would be cool to see and then they up the uh they up the the loot of what people that are going past stage 30 that may say maybe they're leader leaderboard pushing or just pushing in their task force for bragging rights or whatever um and then just give us um a lot more resources of the important type so a lot more crystals uh a lot more power powder maybe some diamonds here and there uh hero tokens and trader tickets because there's a lot more uh resources in general right now that we can be that they could incorporate into the mega crowd and i think that would be a lot of fun and it would make the Mega Crab, um, the push a lot more worth doing than, um, than just, than just boosting and getting as high as you can on it just for the sake of doing just that, you know what I mean? And, and, like, it would make the leaderboard push a lot more fun. I think it would get a lot more people involved in, um, in trying to push the Mega Crab as, as far as they can because there's no real benefit to doing that. Like, it's, it takes a ton of powder, it takes a ton of diamonds. As, as we've seen the chicken spend, but it, it's it's not all about diamonds. It's more about skill and uh, knowing how to hit the base correctly than it is about anything else. Um, but yeah, I think that would be a cool way to get kind of all that stuff incorporated. We're going to go ahead and lose all those Zookas there to that flamethrower. That's fine. Um, and yeah, lots of power power, lots of crystals, lots of uh, trader tickets, lots of hero tokens. I, I feel like that would be a cool way to just kind of incorporate this hero update into uh, all this stuff here. Oh my god, we are not taking this base down, guys. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, so that's basically what I had to say on that. Clearly, we got to focus up here because we're about to get roasted on stage 6, which is, uh, of course, unacceptable. Uh, we'll get the health kit going down there, and I don't think we're actually going to be able to do this, so... Um, we're gonna go ahead, guys, and, uh, yeah, once the shock lars come up, we're gonna be done. So, we're gonna go ahead, and, uh, I'm, I'm gonna switch back to Battle Lords. I, I know I said I was gonna try to get through every ability, but, uh, the Dr. T Volcanoes, man, they are tough for Zookas. They are not the easiest by any means. So, let's go ahead and, um, like, we would've been fine there if I had just, um, if I had just attacked it properly. So, let's go ahead and try to do some, something similar to, uh, to that. Um, are there any free crates over here? I don't want to walk all the way over there with Zuka, so let's just go ahead and do this again, guys. Uh, we'll get the, we'll get the barrage going out on the, uh, on the flamer here. And then we'll go ahead, and I want to clear out all this junk with my artillery. Back, back, back. And then we want to go, um, I want to take out this, and we got brick up. So let's go ahead and do something like that. Launch all the Zookas out nice and quick like, um, oh man, what am I doing? How did I, okay, 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 well, oh my god, we just lost like four bolts doing that, that is not good, guys. Uh, so we'll see if this works, I don't think it's going to. Holy rip, holy rip, we're losing a lot of Zookas. Well, the good thing about shaving off all your troops is that you only need one smoke once you get to the HQ. Um, that's gonna be an unfortunate amount of diamonds that we gotta spend, though. Um, okay, so how do we want to do this chicken? I'm gonna go ahead and get a med kit out, get the critters down. We're gonna shock, 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 shock. Get some more health kits down. Can we do it, guys? How did we How did we take that down with like ten zookas? Okay, chicken. Okay, so hopefully stage seven. Like if if this is what stage six six has in store for us today, I'm a little worried about what stage seven has got on the on the plate today, guys. Um, all right, so 99 gems. Uh, should we scout it or just dive in? I think we all know the answer to that. We all know the answer to that, chicken. 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay, there's, if there's a chicken, there's a way, guys. Hashtag, if there's a chicken, there's a way. That's probably too many characters for Tweeter, but we'll say it anyways. We'll say it anyways. Um, okay, so this is going to be interesting. I got to go something like this, and hopefully we can get most of the Zookas up. All right, okay. We're going to lose that one boat. We're going to lose that one boat. That's fine. That's fine. That's okay. That's okay with the chicken, guys. We got Brick out. We're going to hit that one mine again. Thank you for your contributions, ladies. Much appreciated. Uh, okay, we're gonna get, we're gonna get toasted by the machine gun. Smoke there, smoke there, smoke there. Uh, flare back right over here again. Only need one smoke because we shaved so many off. That's okay. We'll hit the ability, and I think we got three shocks and a critter left, guys. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's what we got left here. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna throw the critters out this way, and then shock, shock. Uh, we got another shock somewhere. I'm gonna go ahead and med kit. And artillery, artillery, come on, come on, come on, battle lords, kick in for us. We've got another artillery on deck here. And boom, stage seven goes down. Back, back, back. So, two absolutely horrible Zooka attacks, guys, but we somehow came away with it. I don't know how, guys. I don't know how. That was, uh, I hope it was um, as enjoyable for you to watch as it uh, was as stressful for the chicken to make it through that. So, let me know what you guys think. Do you think that. Uh, the new Mega Crab should come very soon. Um, would that be something that you would be like ready for with all the hero updates and stuff? I think it would be a good way to farm loot for them just in general because uh, we need a lot of gold. Gold is usually pretty good on Mega Crab. Let me know what you think of the chicken's ideas. Do you think it's just like way out there? Like, do, like there's no way this could happen? Or do you think it's kind of somewhat realistic? Let me know all that down in the comments, guys. That's going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Chicken out. Oh. Just a quick reminder, guys, if you visit patreon.com backslash the chicken for $1 a month, you can get your name in the chicken banner for the duration of the month. And for $2 a month, you become a super chicken and you can get your name in the banner. Plus, uh, you get to write your own personal message.